Welcome back everyone. So today we've got bees that are going in and out of this vent here. As far as we know this vent uh, is an access for underneath a bathtub. So the bees have made their home basically underneath the bathtub. And um, what we're going to do, the laden one is to go and break into the wall. So we're going to do what's called a trap out. Um, we're going to put a box and attach it to this wall and um, hopefully the bees will move, it's got like a cone inside hopefully the bees will move from underneath the bar through the hole into the box and um, this takes a couple of weeks so we'll be doing some checkups on it um, and so this episode will be broken up in a series of days um, to represent obviously how long it took the bees to move from underneath the bath into the box enjoy it <laughs> Okay, we're done. Um, boxes attached to the wall. We've sealed the wall off with uh, what we call Flash Harry. A little trick I've learned from another beekeeper called Hannes. Shout out to Hannes. Thanks so much for this one. Um, put these little guides on to hold the box up from the front and a batten at the back. And uh, yeah, so the box is attached now. Um, but we'll be coming back and forth and checking this box you know, every now and again. Um, if you like what you see, comment. If you don't, give me some tips and tricks. Subscribe to the channel. Um, and obviously, I'm here to learn and hear about new ways to do things. Um, but this is how I do trap outs. This is how I've learned to do trap outs. And um, they work. I've had good success with it. We're just checking on this uh, trap out that we've got here. Um, we set it up the other day. Um, we discovered that the bees, if, if you can focus down here, are going in underneath this pipe here. So what we've done is we've stuffed some sponge into that hole. That'll hopefully hold them out long enough. And then the bees will start going into the, the box. Um, we'll come and check it again in a couple more days. Inspection three on this box. Well, it's the second inspection. Obviously the first was the installation. Looks like the bees are going in and out at the front now. There's one or two bees coming this way, so I'm just checking if they can't get in, but they don't they seem to hover here and then they go back and go in at the front. So we're gonna open the box up, have a look and see what sort of actions on the inside. Okay, we've got a nice clump of bees here. Yeah, this is looking good. So there we can see 
the ladies are making clumping together nicely around the comb that we had put in there so the only thing left to check which we'll check on the next inspection we're not going to disturb them right now is to see whether or not the queen has moved into the box but everything's looking perfect at the moment Okay, um, we haven't been to this box for quite a while. Uh, this is the trap out box that we've had up now, probably going on two months. Um, we had a few issues at the beginning with the bees coming in uh, from the sides, but it looks like we've sorted out that problem. We're going to check now and see if the queen's laying in the comb. Yeah. Okay, there's quite a bunch of bees. Nice cluster of bees. Can you see it there? This is looking really, really good. Yeah. So I'm going to pull some of these frames up now and just see if there's any eggs. Just careful, eh? Yeah, I know. Yes, okay, there's brood. That means we have a queen. This hive's ready to be moved. Okay. Cool, okay, success guys. This was our trap out, started two and a half months ago. Um, it was from underneath the bath. And uh, yeah, we checked now, the queen's in there laying brood, just transported them now to Kailami. And uh, we'll be back in a couple of days, probably to move these guys into a proper hive box because they're already starting to outgrow the four frames. <laughs>just close it off hey so click and subscribe click and subscribe <laughs> like I got it, yeah how do I do it Jan <laughs> yeah, click and subscribe yeah, yeah. So, like click and subscribe yeah, oh, wait. like like and subscribe so give us a thumbs up we, we can't see you in the dark <laughs> one more time one more time so give us a thumbs up like and subscribe thank you okay there we go <laughs> well done some old boy keys. Yeah. yeah. With age comes experience or knowledge. You never ask a farmer who's, where everything works. Always ask the bully who's had to struggle without it. <laughs> without all the tools. <laughs>